The world is full of good news. The following are just a few. Vladimir Rushailo, Russia's recently appointed special envoy to Kyrgyzstan, and Uzbek President Islam Karimov meet and pledge to coordinate efforts to help bring stability to Kyrgyzstan. South Korea donates 100,000 US dollars in relief supplies to Guatemala, including food, drinking water, and medicines to help residents cope with the effects of a recent volcanic eruption and tropical storm. United Kingdom researchers develop a laser a sensor made of an inexpensive polyfluorine plastic that can detect emitted vapors of hidden explosives, which could be useful in such settings as airport luggage screening, security checkpoints, and restoring landmines regions for safe passage. For her birthday, teenager Taylor Spencer of Pennsylvania, USA, hosts a party and asks friends to donate to Haiti instead of giving her gifts, raising over 8,000 US dollars for shelter boxes to provide Haitian families with tents and other essentials. The government of Aulak or Vietnam has thus far provided 1,500 disadvantaged ethnic minority families in Sub Chung province with land upon which to build their homes with the goal of providing for all less fortunate households by year's end. In a life-saving surgery, California USA neurosurgeon Dr. Amin Kassam successfully removes a four-year-old Belgian boy's complex brain tumor using a new device that minimizes invasiveness while providing the highest precision. In Peru's Urubamba province, Spanish cave explorers discover a 3.6 kilometer ancient Inca aqueduct built with advanced engineering to carry water from the ice-covered Mount Veronica to a reservoir below. A Russian aircraft construction company is announcing the Sigma 5, a small lightweight plane with a price close to that of a luxury vehicle that can travel at almost 300 kilometers per hour, can be parked like a large car and can taxi from any any flat surface. The Vietnam Outreach Organization of Australia donates 200 wheelchairs for children with disabilities in the central Nadian and Hatin provinces of Ao Lai or Vietnam. With the goal of encouraging savings and boosting the local economy in Haiti, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, with a five million US dollar donation from US Aid, is offering 10 million US dollars in prizes to the first company that builds successful mobile banking services in the country.